Okay, this video is for anyone having trouble with a Toshiba Satellite P755. The problem with it powering on and then instantly shutting down, or being lucky enough to get to the login screen and then watching it just go blank. So what's going on here is it's the power button. It's this very cheap membrane right here. If I just barely tap on it, that's all it takes to turn it on. So when this is all put together, if I just go like this, just like that, not even feeling it click, it will turn on. Now consequently, basically the button is almost always being forced down, and that's why it won't stay turned on. It's like you're just always holding down the power button. Uh, here's the ribbon cable that goes to it. Power, it's uh, for the button and the little LED here, power indicator. These cost 50 bucks online, if you can find them, and they don't last very long, so unplug it. Thankfully, now this model seems to have all kinds of weird stuff going on, so like if I plug it in, all right, I'm plugging in the, the uh, media keys here. This is what's going to save us, at least with this particular laptop. All right, if I plug it in, you'll notice that this happens, which shows there's more things messed up than that because this is turned off, it's not sleeping those lights should not be coming on. So unplugged, it goes off, plugged in, comes on. Um, we got cellular, I'm not, I don't, oh yeah, SD card and hard drive light on. Now, thankfully, with this one anyways, if I just kinda touch these keys here, it turns on. So that's gonna be the fix. And you'll see it actually goes on all the way and it will not suddenly turn off. If I plug in that power button, um, it will just go into an endless loop because the button is stuck down basically and uh, they only last about six months at the most at first I thought this was the problem so I was trying to run it without it but um, if you unplug this um, then you also don't have the unfortunately the uh, this counts as the hardware switch for Wi-Fi so if this is unplugged you cannot get Wi-Fi to work no matter what because it acts like the hard switch it's a goofy design, but it's what Toshiba did, so there's no way around it. Um, for fun, maybe I'll plug this in just so you can see what I'm talking about. Because this is so bizarre. I've never seen anything like this before. Alright, let me pull that out. It's fun though when you get this figured out because it's just so bizarre. It's not your typical, not your average computer problem. All right, so now, and of course, all right, there we go. I barely, the reason why I pressed down so much is because this isn't clicked in. So we'll see, it might actually, nope. See, there we go, turned off already. And um, let me go and unplug this. If I just barely touch this. Oh, it's actually, oh, there we go. Let's see, I'm not touching it. Nothing is touching it. Let's see if it'll stay on. Off. So yeah, there's your fix. And fortunately, because of these, you can get away without having to have an actual power button. So uh, yeah, check it out.